image conscious Jane Fonda, now 85, was left temporarily crippled when she was filming the 1979 movie The China Syndrome with Michael Douglas. After falling over and breaking her foot, she was launched into panic, racing against the clock to keep her body toned and supple in time to shoot her next big movie a month later. Prior to the accident, she had been hooked on ballet, practicing the dance form almost every day. Yet, as she prepared to appear in California Suite, she realized that training was impossible. Her solution came a few weeks later, as her foot had started to heal, in the form of the workout studio recommended by her. Oh, my God, it had a huge impact on me! she exclaimed. She began attending the Gilda Marx studio and dance instructor Lenny Kasdan blew her away. Later, she realized that she could turn her discovery into a profitable business venture. Video production entrepreneur Stuart Carl approached her, keen to see her replicate her legendary weight loss moves on tape. Yet there was one problem, Jane hadn't yet heard of a video player. At the time nobody had a VCR. I didn't even know what a VCR was, she told Vogue magazine. However Carl was insistent that a home workout video could transform people's lives and earn them a great profit in the process. Then the subject was broached of donating proceeds to a charity she had founded with her then-husband Tom Hayden, the Campaign for Economic Democracy. Finally, Jane agreed, and the rest was history. Dot we spent no money on it. I wrote the script myself on a hotel room floor, Jane chuckled. The star even shunned the concept of a makeup artist, opting to create a look on her own. Eventually the video came out, and of course it remains the number one selling home video of all time, Jane exclaimed. Nobody's ever broken that record, the excited star continued. The movie legend had been photographed by Vogue in dramatic black and white shots depicting her doing her dance training prior to breaking her foot. The world had been watching her famous routines ever since she starred in classic films like Barbarella, released in 1968. It was only natural that she would ultimately share the knowledge of how she maintained her physique with the rest of the world. After all, Jane is a firm believer that exercise and activism are the two best antidotes for depression, 